This is uh, Country Living E Oregon Style 61. Uh, we're going to make some seasoned chili seasoning mix. It makes a quarter of a cup. You can do more than that if you want to. But this particular recipe makes a quarter of a cup. You can double, triple, whatever you want to do. The quarter of a cup is like if you were buying the packets out of the store that says medium, mild, ch chili, or um, hot, whatever. This is kind of a kind of a cross between a medium and a hot. It's not real hot, but it's not. It's just kind of a medium blend as far as hotness. Okay, we need two tablespoons of where'd it go? There it is. Um, chili powder. more later if you want it but this is your this would be the packet type that you would put into your hamburger and all the stuff that you're using you know to make your chili this is the seasonings that go in it one tablespoon here we go that seasoning salt that we made teaspoons of cumin this is exactly what your packets have got in it if you bought it at the store outside it doesn't have the preservatives teaspoon of oregano those up because I you really want them crushed but I'm just gonna crush them up with my fingers. Teaspoon of salt. Teaspoonful of onion powder. There again, I'll put them down below. I'll write the recipe out and and put it down below in the description box. Half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Well, maybe I should take the lid off. It'll be hard to get. That is it. That's all that goes in it. That was all that's in that packet that you buy, pay over a dollar for. Unless you buy a generic brand. Just mix it up. Where your wire whisk comes in handy, you need to have one of them. It's a lot easier to to mix things up if you have a little wire whisk. Anyway, that's all there is to it. Let's see if I can get it without getting it in front of you. Let's see if I can hit the jar next. There you go. Chili seasoning mix to add to your beans, your hamburger, your onions, all that stuff to make your chili. Thank you again for watching.